Hello guys, this is Copycat and we are playing Frostborn. I just want to show you guys something how to actually end a quest. Now, some of you guys are asking about how to end a quest and it's actually quite easy because these are the quests that's available. You're going from 1 to 10 and you can just keep on actually making these quests. Uh, they're not going in the loop, that's not what I meant, but actually when you're building three walls like this in the camp, you're going to actually press claim and then you get this price right here the spear and if you're premium vip you get this as well so you can just keep on going with that and they will just pop up when you're actually done them and then you have to go into this one in the top where is this 16 uh the little book uh cover right there is actually showing off so you can see these are the price that you're going to get and those of you haven't actually opened up the other ones, I will just show you guys what you're actually capable of getting. See, there's different kind of things right here. Just uh, these uh, fire grenades are pretty cool, actually. And of course, some gold that's not dumb at all. And remember, you every time you get, like in this one, you get uh, this hat right here and this pair of boots. But if you had the premium, you will also get the, the war staff as well and another thing. So you can keep on seeing that. It's actually much better when you're a VIP, but even though you have to pay for that. So this is what you get in level three. Just going to go through that. And of course you get this key right here. Uh, I'm going to claim that because I'm going to show you guys where you're actually going to put that in. So just going to claim that. Uh, let's just see right here. We keep on going. Level four right here. Remember, there's different tasks, so you have to go down, example, attack enemies in the camp during a raid, and so on. So you have to do these tasks. Uh, level 5, let's look at this. Pretty cool. Gadget right here that you can get. Note. Level 6 right here. It's giving you a bow and a lot of extra things right now you have to do um some of these are actually harder than the other one and you can take this um this one right here is actually something that you can purchase with uh in in the map so don't you don't have to rate these areas or sorry rate you have, don't have to loot these areas every time you just spend these points instead and in this area you actually get five of them as well so you just keep on Going with this, you can see this is what I'm actually at right now. And the next thing I have to do is to actually cut down five maple trees in the forest of shadow uh, to claim the last one. And when that's finished, I'm at this one right here. So uh, I'm not incapable of watching what's inside of this, but as you can see, I've made seven out of eight of these tasks ready. So that's how you make your mission finish but there's also another thing that i'm talking about is actually making your uh, district uh, better and by filling out everything inside of this card right here uh, all of these items so if i just fill in this you heard that sound and then i'm actually going to level that up so what you have to do is go and exit right here and then you add world map and down to the district you have to go and you have to run of course inside of this there's two areas if you take press enter and take the enter the popular one that's not the one you have to choose you have to choose enter your own area and that's because you're going to make your own so if you're on level one you have to make each and every step like in the popular one so the popular one is only activating these uh, new items that actually um, extra uh, yeah quest and all of that so that's the only thing you can use it for a plus also uh, it's going to level up this these right here and you can see the video i made about that um these are the tax that you get every day actually you have to go down to this guy right here and then you're incapable of getting your mission done for making the district so now i'm going to level this up and you can see i get these items right here 
uh, not this getting them, but actually capable of making them. So. Now I have to do the fortress as well. So as we can see, I'm just leveling up this. And right now the district is level uh, 46 and the next one is 51, I think. I'm going to change to 51. So I'm capable of making this now and yeah. Another thing that I'm actually capable of making is this one. So this is actually one of the good thing getting being capable of having more inside of your uh, backpack. So if you want to make a new level uh, in the district, you still have to fill up this charge right, uh, card right here. And now it's changing every time. And if you have one of these in 100, this one right here, the silvers, um, and you don't have any silvers, the way you get silvers is by getting uh, taxes every day. You just take that and making these quests right here they are giving silvers as well uh 30 silver for getting two block mushrooms at um one of these areas so you can watch all the tasks that you're up and going for at this area uh, so we have to actually put in these 120 silvers by doing that just press the plus i like that's done and then you have to fill out all the others uh, if you have these items in your cap, of course, otherwise you have to get them. So that's how you actually do this. It's, uh, it's pretty easy, actually. And just for a little bonus for you guys, uh, I definitely want you to see how to get these one. You get them by making the tournament. And in the tournament, you can also win a lot of prizes. Uh, one of the prizes are these one right here, these small chests. You can see I have seven of them. I want to open all of them for you guys to see what's inside of it. So when we press this one, it's going to calculate and take one of them and keep on doing this. Now we have six. We have actually have six uh, opportunities to get all one of these items right here. And then seventh is on this area. So let's just see. Oh, we're actually quite lucky there. That's all what you have right there. Now I claim all of them and you can see all my prices just fill up. I have 24 bandits and healing say, uh, so as well as a lot of food and so on and so on. So that's how you guys do it. I hope you guys enjoy this. And of course, remember, you can do these things as well. So see you guys later. Bye. Once again.